Oh, hello, me hearties. Dinky do. It's just me, Scotty McClure. A very, very warm welcome to our Friday night pop up, a random pop up. It's just coming up to half past nine on Friday evening, and it's lovely to have you with us. And a good dinky do to you, I say. Welcome, welcome, welcome. You're watching Scotty McClure, the first lord of the internet and the world stop broadcaster. And uh, we did pop up earlier, of course for the early evening pop-up and now this is the grown-ups version where we don't get the wee trolls they are off to their bubbles so they are fantastic stuff and it means we can get a good bit of chat going so do come and join us Remember, this live was started because the news is so depressing and we wanted people to have something nice and lighthearted and fun to join. So do come and join us. You're very, very welcome. We're live on TikTok, one of the greatest world streaming platforms. And, of course, I am Scotty McClue. There's Susan saying good evening from Ayrshire. We love Ayrshire. Fantastic. There's Top of the Morning saying, do you support Palestine? Yes, I support I support Palestine and I also support Israel. I support the two of them in equal measure and I want them to stop this chucking stuff at each other, chucking ordnance at each other. So there we go. Follow us as soon as you come on, guys. We're desperately short of followers and desperately big on viewers. Tremendous amount of viewers, but we need to get people actually clicking follow. Uh, so there we go. Hi from Essex. Lovely to have you with us. Can you please say hi to Sophie and Mads? Of course I can. Think you do. So there we are. Follow us as soon as you come on. You're an icon, says old Magnum, old Magnum, I thank you. What are your pronouns? Well, we don't do pronouns on here. It's old-fashioned, and it's a little bit rude because we're all inclusive. So there we are, fantastic stuff. Now, uh, him name, I think we'll send you down the river because you've said Candice and Everdice, who says that gets banned because the joke's just worn far too thin now. So there we are. Do you think we'll be in another lockdown? Well, do you know, Angela, I am concerned about that. You know, I don't actually um, want that, because for our own sanity and for our own health and well-being, we need to get out and get back to work as a nation. Still games, says Andy, good for you. How long have you been on, Scotty? Ooh, at least 30 seconds, Greg. I would tell you. How are you doing this evening, Mr. Scott McClure? Yorkshire Bud, thank you for that lovely present of a TikTok and a mic. Thank you. Uh, do you support Palestine? Yes, I support Palestine and Israel in equal measure because they are beautiful countries full of beautiful people and they need to stop chucking ordnance at each other. Are you for real? I hope so. Let me check. Oh, yes, I'm from real. Uh, any advice on my friend? So there we are. I don't know. Uh, there's some dimension candies, so we'll just send them down the river. As a lifetime ban for anybody that says candies. That's that gone. Okay, it's just wearing a bit thin, I tell you that. Follow us as soon as you come on, guys. We need more and more followers. Fantastic stuff. We love that. Are you from Scotland? I hope so. There's Multi Big Daddy. Let's get him away doing the swanee as well. Fantastic. We love that. He'll not be back. Superb. Are you watching? Woo! Bye, Big Daddy. There we go. Now, <clears throat> what's your opinions on leaving the UK? Are you leaving the UK, Shauna? Where are you going? Do tell us, I ask you. Uh, so there we go. Do you think the Rangers should march to George Square? Certainly not. Certainly not. Absolutely. That would be very poor form. And it would look as if they were disobeying the uh, feelings of the nation. Are you from Scotchland? No. There's no such thing as Scotchland. Scotch is something you drink. There we are. What's your opinion on legal? Well, we've done that one, haven't we? Yes, indeed. Uh, what have I got here? Scotty hugs and kisses wolf. 
Top staff, dinky do to you. Can you tell me if the folk singer Alistair McDonald's still with us? He was magic. I saw him in the shops a few years ago, and he was looking amazing. Sean McCloskey, thank you very much indeed. Uh, coaster head, you need to go and grow up. Yep, see if you can uh, come back on when your voice breaks. <clears throat> Excellent stuff, Coaster head gone. Good, get rid of the idiots early on, I think so. Uh, party in Glasgow tomorrow, here we come. Yes, here we spread the COVID. That's what you lot will be doing, so it'd be great if you didn't do that. Watching from Helensborough, Scotty. We love Helensborough, Sinclair Street. Uh, I've already left the UK. What about you? No, I still live in it, Shono. Absolutely, but good luck wherever you are. Uh, Dinky do. thank you, Sean, for that lovely TikTok. You're very, very kind. What do you think of Corbin, an outstanding human being, a lovely uh, character treated very, very, very badly by the right wing media? But, uh, you know, I mean, I'm not political. I just think he's an outstanding human being and he should still be leader of the Labour Party. I would have said. Uh, but there we are, the Labour Party, no best. Maria Knight has sent 100 TikToks. Maria you are such a beautiful person. Thank you so much. You've, you've, you've become my sponsor. You are so kind. Uh, are you from Glassford? No, I'm from Glasgow. <laughs> Thank you. Hello, Scotty. Thank you. Hello, everybody. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Who have we got here? What's your thoughts on people being allowed to buy their council house? Well, there's two ways of looking at it. What do you mean? You see, you can never actually own anything. You can only curate it. So whether you go for the mortgage or the loan or the kunso hus, it's entirely up to yourself. But a lot of people cleaned up. They got properties for about £6,000 because they've been in them for a long time. When are you going to start selling your badges, Scotty? When I get one million followers. So it's entirely in your hands, guys. Get following as soon as you come on. Uh, there's Jack showing the Union flag. Uh, so there we are. Show that, Jack, because I don't know how long that'll be about. In uh, a year or two's time, it might just be the white background and the St. George's Cross. The rest will have scarpered. Greetings from Dumbarton, Dinky Doo Dumbarton. We love it. And we love you guys. Dinky Doo Scotty. Hi, Ishpo. Maria, thank you so much for that 100 TikTok. So very, very good of you. Wonderful, wonderful stuff, I say. Now then, if you've just joined us, a very warm welcome. You're watching Scotty McClue, the Fossil Lord of the Internet, the world's top broadcaster. This is the big one nationwide. Celtic or Rangers, Scotty, my advice would be go and see them both play and then make up your mind who you're going to follow. And you can, you can change if you don't like the one you've chosen. So there we are. What do you think of women's leggings, Scotty? Ishable, you don't see them so much now. So there you are, very, very rarely. Shout out to my friend Andrew from Edinburgh. Are you a Tory? No, I don't know what a Tory is. And I am apolitical. I don't follow politics. Hello from South Africa. Lovely to have you with us. Thank you, do. A loop says free Palestine, yes, and free Israel. The two of them need to get together and sit around the big table. There we are. Fantastic stuff. Come and join us as quickly as you can, guys. Hello from East Kilbride. We love East Kilbride, the home of the roundabout. Um, why are you sweating, son? Very, very hot in the studio, son. I didn't realize I was, but I'll have a wee comfort break. Thank you, Ross. Oh, oh fantastic. Roasting hot in here tonight. I don't know what's gone on. So there we are. Now, Polo Mint City. Yes, indeed. Who have we got here? Now, oops, there's Tory Track. Tory Track, what we'll do with you is just 
send you down the river until you grow up. Come back when your voice breaks, okay, and we'll do some chat then once you've grown up. Why do the Irish call the Union Jack a butcher's apron? Because they feel that it's got blood on it from all the conflicts over the years. The biggest grey wizard is just about to get uh, dumped for mentioning Candice. Bye-bye. There we go. Wonderful. Big grey wizard's gone, guys. Hello, hello, hello. Lovely to have you with us and dinky do. Now, I've got so much to talk about tonight, guys. If you've just joined us, make sure every single one of you has followed us. If you haven't followed, please get guilt tripped as much as you possibly can. There we are. You're sweating, Scotty. Yes, I should be better now, though. I've just had a wipe down. There we are. Fantastic. A wipe down with a wet flannel. <laughs> That's the stuff. Right, let's get liking. Can somebody be dispatched to like all Scotty McClue's TikTok videos? Can somebody else ensure that everybody follows us as soon as they come on? Jesus loves you and you need to repent. Well, I don't actually need to repent because I've never sinned. But, um, you know, I, I do love Jesus and Jesus loves me. In fact, we don't just love each other. We adore each other. Fantastic stuff. What's the favorite book you've ever read? Connor, I think when I was a child, I read Enid Blyton and I read Beatrix Potter. And I read The Noddy Books by Enid Blyton. Fantastic stuff. And Dinky Doo. There we are. Now, uh, Scotty McClure will help you to find your way. Uh, what have we got here? Why are you known as the first lord of the internet? I think, Archie, it's because I have two billion people know Scotty McClure. And when that many people know you, you become the first lord of the internet, you see? Fantastic stuff. Follow us as soon as you can, guys. Have you ever stolen something? Never in my life. Independent Scotland in the European Union. Absolutely, Richard, well done. Do come and join us, guys, and follow as soon as you come on. This is TikTok's Top Talk Show. Don't ever miss a second of Scotty McClue or you miss a moment of life. Greetings and salutations from Siberia. Dinky do, I say, from Siberia. Now, I see Rangers or Celtics as ransoms. Go and see them both play ransoms. Make up your mind. They're both excellent football teams, actually. <coughs> now, what have we got here? Here. Are you a lord of the manor? No, no, I'm not actually a lord of the manor. I don't have that title. I did have access to a title once, and I said to my father, should I use this title? And he said, I wouldn't bother with all that. You'll end up selling tickets for things. <laughs> I love it. He was a wonderful, wonderful man. Guys, follow us, please. Don't go out tonight. And yes, you're red and white. There we are. What about uh, don't go out tonight unless you're green and white? There we are. That would be a good one as well, wouldn't it? Do you know Vietnam? Well, if you can hum it, I'll join in. That's what I would say. Hello, mate. Dink you do. I see there's trouble on the way. There may be trouble ahead. How much money would you pay to see an hour montage? of you and your friend's best moments, or at least a quid. There we go. How much money? So, oh, we've just done that, haven't we? <laughs> Sorry about that. Pronouns, we don't use them on here. They're root and old-fashioned. How much money? Oh, yes, we've just done that one. Have you been to, hang on a minute, I think we'll get free leafy. You need to go because you're spamming us now. We don't have spammers on here. If you're asking, guys, then you just ask once. Um, how good are Scotland going to do in the Euros? I think they'll do very well. They did very well in the pound sterling. How much money? Oh, yes, we've done that one, haven't we? We've just banned you for that. Um, spamming, spamming. As soon as you get a spammer, guys, they're down the river. So there we go. Woof, 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 Rizala. Fantastic. Who have I got here? Now, turn on your AC, bro. You're sweating. Yes, are we again? Right? No problem at all. Oh. 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 Ah. 
We don't have AC in Scotland. It's called opening a window. Fantastic. So there we are. I like your voice. Thank you very much. Uh, where are you from? We're from here. Why are you sweating? Because it's roasting hot in the studio with the big lights on, you see. It doesn't come itself, you know, the lighting. What part of Scotland would you recommend a foreigner? Well, you see, I don't believe there's such a thing as a foreigner. You're just one of our universal brothers or sisters. I would recommend you see every single bleed of grass of Scotland. Fantastic part of the world, you know. What do you think of the Irish? I love and adore the Irish, and uh, I'm an expert on Ireland. So there are followers, guys, as soon as you come on. So there we are. Are you black? Well, we were all originally black, and uh, then people got paler by moving um, round the world. We're not sweating now, Hubba, so you're okay, la. Don't you worry about that. Who have we got here? Uh, oh, Roger, you'll have to go from mentioning Candice. Hey, blocked, blocked. Right, lifetime ban, remember, guys? Every Christian in this life, God wants you to start preaching the gospel. Well, we always preach the gospel on here. What do you think of the party tomorrow? It would be very, very wrong. Scotty, what did you do for a living? I still do for a living. I'm a very young man. I just had a tough paper round. Simple as that, I tell you. Uh, King Kenyon's mentioned Candice. He has to go down the river. Bye, King Kenyon. Woo! Uh, anybody else mentioning? Oh, there's another candy. He goes towels. Yes, uh, wonderful stuff. That's what we like. There we are. Uh, now, guys, if you're coming on to this live, this is TikTok's top talk show. You don't do any trolling. You behave yourself. Yes, you have respect for others. You don't ask any filth. All that is lifetime ban for you. And we don't discuss anything negative. Okay, so there we are. We are positive on here. He's not wrong. I'm not wrong. There we are. Uh, sweat or... Oh. Alex Ward, you'll have to go. Yep, very wrong thing to say. There we are. Fantastic. Good afternoon from San Antonio in Texas. We love you in Texas, San Antonio. What's the best part of your life? Talking live to all of you on TikTok. National and international television. National radio. Yes, indeed. Uh, being the top DJ, what's your best newspaper? Well, I've written for so many newspapers. I don't really have a best one. I love them all, but sadly, people aren't really reading newspapers very much these days. Uh, there's somebody saying that Rangers died in 2012. Bravo, thank you so much for that. Guys, if you're feeling generous, then uh, you can pop us a TikTok. That's always uh, lovely. Or uh, you can actually, if you look at my profile, I think there's a, a paypal.me forward slash Scotty McClue on there. I'm not a Christian, says we don't panic would. You know, there are many, many great religions in the world besides Christianity. What to do for a living? I, uh, I live stream on the internet. There's Sean the Sheep going down the Swanee for mentioning Candice. He can't even spell it, actually. <laughs> He's gone right by, Sean. There we are. Fantastic stuff. Is the Isle of Man worth a visit? Well, I'm very, very well known on the Isle of Man. There's our Princess Maria Nightback giving me TikToks, the most generous woman in the world. Uh, what have you not to say? You just have to not say, Candice. Uh, shout out from the US, also an American Scot here. Polly, lovely to have you with us in Dinky Do. Grrr, says Sean the Sheep. He's been binned. So who have we got here? Love your voice. It's like drinking fine whiskey. I thank you, Nico. I wouldn't know because I don't drink alcohol. 
I am from Poland. Lovely. I live in the Isle of Man. Oh, tell us all about it, please. We love hearing from you. Fantastic. I've just joined. What's wrong with mentioning the name? Well, it's because it's a joke that went wrong on TikTok. People don't know when to stop, and it's no use to us on here, if you see what I mean, because we are big chat about interesting things. So any little troll coming on to put the same kind of nonsense they would put on another live is not wanted. Thank you, Maria, and thank you, Alex, for your generosity. Guys, this is so kind of you. Do you watch the European Song Contest? Very much so. I think I would be very good at commentating on the European Song Contest. Didn't you do? You see, there's somebody putting the same as they put on every live. They're going, Daddy. I mean, how unclever and unfunny is that? There we are. Now, um, what degrees do you have, Scotty? Two degrees. There we are, both in arts. So there we go. Now, uh, RBMC, you did have to be the silly person, didn't you? So let's just say bye to you. There we go. Fantastic. Good. Gone. Not funny. Um, hi from South Wales. We love you, South Wales. Uh, now there's Rocket being very silly as well. Okay, Rocket, you need to just go and grow up, la. Then come on when you're a big boy and you can talk to Scotty then. Hi, can you say howdy to my family? Yes, I can, Parrot. What was your favorite subject in school? All of them. English, history, maths, physics, chemistry, um, principles of accounts, it was called then. French, fantastic. I didn't do German or Spanish. Welcome to the system. Some people can see the message, others can't. You've been chosen. Thank you. Very kind of you. Oh, Tufty Clips, thank you so much for sending me that wonderful, wonderful thing. Who's the chap behind? That's me. Hang on, guys. Quick comfort break. Back in a second. <coughs> oh. There we go. Fantastic. Can you speak any other languages? Which languages would you like? Did you enjoy school? I loved school, Haba, but I wanted to get out and get on with life. You look really sweaty. I am really sweaty. It's roasting hot here. There we go. Fantastic. Now, have you done a DNA ancestry test? No, but they're very interesting because people that say, I'm a pure British person, usually find they're from Argentina or something like that. What do you call a shoe made out of a banana? A slipper. Are you into politics? I'm into politics, but I'm apolitical. I'm not a political person. Jesus is coming. I think he's here, WSG. So there we go. I think we're ahead of you there. What? Um, this is loud, so sexy. Yes, absolutely sexy. Of course it's loud. Can you sell me your hat? Where do I recognize you from? From the television, from the radio, from the newspapers, you know, all that sort of stuff. Calm down, says Jack. Good, Jack. Well done. Radio Britain. Yes, indeed. Uh, who have we got here? That's two seconds. Wonderful. We like that. Fantastic. Now then, uh, good evening, Scotty, dinky-doo. Where are you from? We're from Scotland. You're sweating so hard. Not anymore. I've just had a wipe down. There we are. Uh, have a lovely night. Fantastic. Dinky-doo. Ireland and Scotland, beautiful countries. We love it. Fantastic stuff. Now, hold on a minute till I deal with these people, guys. The wee trolls are away down the river. Look, look, look. Fantastic. Who else is going with? Let's see who else is going. Oh, John Boy is going. Good, John Boy. Well done. Wonderful. That's him. Fantastic. Now they are turning the heating off. The heating's off. You know, I was working very hard out in the garden just before I came on. <coughs> give me a dinky do. I can give you a dinky do. Fantastic. Brother, what color of toothbrush? Uh, I think the present one is purple. Same color as FIFA, who's just about to get dumped. 
<laughs> we love it. We bit of fun tonight, guys. There you go. Fantastic. That's FIFA dumped. Fantastic. Good evening, my friend. How are you tonight? We are beautiful, Jimmy. Outstanding. Uh, Jesus is King. The Lord Messiah loves you. The mighty Prince of Peace. I say, dinky do the Messiah. Yes, can you please send respects to my friend? I can, yes. Big respects to your friend and down the swanee with you. <laughs> Wonderful, you'll not be back. Now, Scotland forever, I'm Scottish. What do you think about an independent Scotland? Yes, I think it would do extremely well economically. Very, very good for it. Sweat means hard work. Well, I've been working very, very hard tonight before I came on. And I think when you sit down, it comes out of you. Bro, I'm from Australia. Your accent sums up everything I thought it would be. Thank you, do, Walla Brow. Lovely to have you with us. Now, I do share the live, guys, and follow us. So there we are. God, I love my For Your page. Thank you so much, Haley. Very kind of you. Has everybody followed us, guys? Apparently, if you tap, then you will get um, access to all my TikTok videos. And they're all for you. Enjoy every second of them. Favorite movie? We think the imitation game with Benedict Cumberbatch as Alan Turing. There we are, the guy that cracked the Enigma code during the Second World War at Bletchley Park. Mine too, you love that one, excellent stuff. Um, H. Trappy, I think we'll get rid of that nonsense. I can't be bothered with people that come on going, Daddy, because they've got nothing else to say. Try and think of something intelligent. This is grow up time for you guys. There's a guy who loves old people. Good. Well, when the rest of us are old, perhaps you'll, you'll love us as well, Alan. Well done. Fantastic. Have you got a lot in your family? Why do vampires look so sick? Because they're always coughing. <laughs> Yeah. I am currently reading, and he's, he talks about Hitler's book. Interesting read that, Logan, is it? I've always wanted to go there. Where should I go to visit? Everywhere. The whole place is magical. Dinky do, Trump is king. Fantastic. We love it. Uh, I was in Scotland before the pandemic. It's so pretty. It's beautiful. Fantastic. Thank you very much, Grace, for sharing. Can you all follow us, guys? We need lots more followers and lots and lots of likes, please. <coughs> no, dinky do, dinky do. Hello from the Broch from Fraserborough, dinky do. Hello, the Broch, the Broch. Wonder, there's a lot of people on from the Broch. Have you still got a hand in radio? Uh, no, not at the moment, Phil Stern. I sold all my radio shares. Dinky do, dinky do, 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 Norway forever. Sophia, my father was one of your liberators in 1944. Isn't that wonderful? There we are. I love your accent. Where are you from? I am from Scotland. What's up, Scotty? Everything's up, Dylan. Nothing is down. How superb is that? Happy birthday. Absolutely tons. Dinky-doo, my friends, from Iowa in the USA. Howie, lovely to have you with us from Iowa. Guys, get on to Scotty McClue's YouTube channel. You'll see the link just down there. If anybody's feeling generous, stick five bucks into paypal.me forward slash Scotty McClue. Follow us, guys. Hi, I'm from Ireland. Dinky-doo. We love Ireland. Alex, dinky-doo, follow us as soon as you come on, guys. Thank you so much. We're having a fall of fest. There's a guy going Trump forever. I think probably that ship has sailed, don't you? <laughs> I've stumbled across an absolutely wonderful man, says user. User, what a lovely thing to say. Do you think Mosley was a coward? No, I don't think he was a coward. He was an aristocrat and a fascist. You know, that's uh, what he was. I remember saying to my mother, what was Oswald Mosley like? And she said, well, he was a perfect menace, to be quite honest. She was quite straight talking, my mother. I wish she'd passed it on to me. Wonderful, right? Gonna have another wipe down, guys. Woo! Still roasting hot in here. A very, very warm studio. Hello from Inverurie. We love Inverurie. Yes. Do you remember, uh, there used to be a wonderful song, I'm the quine that does the strip at Inverurie. 
<laughs> now, there we go. What have we got here? Hello, Scotty. Dinky do. Hi, hun. Dinky do. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Wood. I think we'll dump that because that's very childish. That's not what we do on here. Remember, if you're coming on, guys, grown up, proper language. There we are. No wee trolls posting the same caca that they post on other people's lives. Love the video, sister. So thank you, Christopher. Can you tell CJ happy birthday, darling? Yes, indeed. Genetic God, thank you so much for my gift box. You are very, very kind. Guys, thank you for all these lovely gifts, for the TikToks, for supporting me, for following, for liking all the lives, for sharing all the lives. Tremendous, wonderful. Now, who we got here? Love the videos. Um, what do we got here? We've got uh, Andrew. I've just answered that. Guys, see if you're asking a question. Don't put it on again. It looks like you're spamming. Uh, intelligent. Dinky do, Harry, thank you. What do we got here? <clears throat> Come on, man, cities, or somebody. No, it's not. It's gone down again. Has it gone down, Trixie? Your local cactus. Thank you for these beautiful gifts. Thoughts on Enoch Powell? Well, a very interesting politician, but of course, very right wing and um, very racist in his speech. And uh, he got sacked by Edward Heath. So there we are, Enoch Powell. Yes, uh, Irish chap, wasn't he? Um, I'm from Glasgow, says Trixie. Dinky do, Trixie. Here from the Barnes, Web King. We love the Barnes. Who's sending me a beautiful book? Maria, I might have known. Everything beautiful that gets sent is Maria. We love it. Absolutely beautiful. Thank you so much, guys. Uh, mind saying hi to Seb, Alfie, and Nick. Yes, we always do. Excellent energy. Thank you. Hello from Edinburgh in Scotland. Dinky do. Grunge. You need to go and grow up. Come back when your voice breaks. Okay. Fantastic. There's grunge gone. There we go. If you can't uh, say grown up stuff, don't come on with all that nonsense. Biden forever, says Sophie. What do we think of that, guys? We seem to be having a dichotomy here. Spencer, you might as go. You know the rules. There we are. Spencer's away. Very unfunny. Very unfunny man, our Spencer. My friend is in hospital. I'm sorry to hear that, but you need to go and see him and not troll other people's lives. Follow us, guys, as soon as you possibly can. Hello from the free world. Hello, TFI. Bye-bye. <laughs> we love it. <laughs> Love the dafties. Thoughts on Notre Dame? Well, uh, you know, I think um, he probably has been proved right on a number of occasions, hasn't he? There we are. I love you, says Nish. Thank you, Nish. Very kind of you. Right, here we got here. Love you, Scotty. Steve Jumps. Jumps. Lovely to have you with us. Kilmarnock here. Hello, Logan. We love Kilmarnock. How fantastic is that? Tremendous. Thank you, Maria, for that beautiful gift of the placard. Trolls when dinky do, dinky don't. Absolutely, there should be no trolls on here. OMG, what am I looking at? You're looking at the world's top broadcaster, the first lord of the internet, TikTok's live talk talk show. That's what you're looking at. Thoughts on Patrick Pierce. He was an interesting character, but uh, he had some very unpleasant thoughts uh, as well. And of course, um, he wasn't particularly good for the cause of Ireland. So there we are. That's Paul Patrick Pierce. Fantastic. Dinky do. Hello again, Scotty. Dinky do. Last night's live was amazing. Was it not just? I am amazed at the quality of these lives. Apart from the idiots, few e trolls, nothing. Doesn't matter. But the quality of the chat is outstanding. Here we go. There's user 102 wanting a wee ban. Bye bye, user 102. <coughs> we love it. Hello from Florida. There we are. My comment sounds mean. I'm sorry, not at all, Ben. No problem at all. 
Fair dinkum, says Logan. Fair dinkum, I'll tell you that. Lovely to have you with us. And a very, very warm welcome. Now, sip of water for McClue. Hi, I'm Cuthbert from Inverness, now living in the US. Much love. Just a quick wipe down, guys. Very hot tonight. Woo! 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 Very, <coughs> very, very warm in the studio tonight. Absolutely incredible. Maria, thank you for my lipstick. Pierce was a hero. He had his flaws and he knew himself uh, if there were to be unity in Ireland. No, what, uh, what Pierce didn't realize was he went about things the wrong way. He made a lot of people very angry instead of going and having a meeting with them. You see, what uh, when you're going to get terrorism, guys, politics has failed. So it means that your point wasn't particularly good in the first place. So I don't think that Pierce was good for Ireland. And uh, I don't know about the hero thing. I think I would, I would be careful about that one. Thoughts on Neville Chamberlain? He was a, a nice enough guy. Um, and uh, he had some very interesting points. He wasn't keeping well latterly. I think if I remember, he was suffering from cancer. Uh, you know, but uh, he did do his best. Uh, would an independent Scotland of a president? Well, the Queen is the head of state in an independent Scotland and always will be her heirs and successors. I mean, the First Minister has just sworn her oath of allegiance to Her Majesty the Queen. So the Queen is the head of state. She's the head of Scotland. Your First Minister is the head of the political side. So there we are. We have that. Do you watch Formula One? Not so much now. It's a bit noisy for me now. Dev was a traitor. He ratted out Michael. Well, we don't know that. We don't know who shot Michael Collins to this day. We just don't know. And I wouldn't be too hard on Dev because he lasted well and he was good for Ireland. You know, the tall fellow with a long shadow. You know, we liked him. Good guy. Fantastic. Just getting shot of some people, guys. Right, there we go. The odd wee troll doing the swarrier, you know? Um, for some reason, these people go round lives. They don't listen to the live. They post the same junk that they post on other people's lives. And they think that it'll be funny. So there we are. Uh, so Nicola Sturgeon's your first minister. Yes, absolutely. Any good books or shows you recommend? Stacks, Alex. My house is falling down with books. Books. You know, and you've got that plus the internet. Incredible, I say. What a wonderful, wonderful live tonight, guys. Just amazing. Watch your pronouns, George. We don't do that. We feel people asking about pronouns is rude. And we also feel it's old-fashioned. You see, because we're all inclusive on here. We're very up-to-date. This is the latest on here. Uh, you know, Dev carried, carried on the IRA about which you have much doubt. Yeah, but he was never too sure of them, really. Do you know what I mean? You've got to be careful about an army that doesn't put on a proper uniform, march down the street, go on the radio, it would be. There wasn't any television in 1916. Go on the radio, uh, go on the television, go in the newspapers and say, Hi, just to say I'm the commander of the army and that we are declaring war, that sort of thing. You see, can you see where I'm coming from? S-71, you're going to have to go bye byes because you know you shouldn't be mentioning Candice. There we are. Thoughts on Israel. Fantastic country full of beautiful people. Gaza, fantastic country. Palestine, full of beautiful people. And uh, there's been no real peace in the land for 2,000 years. They need to get their act together. You need a big leader. You see, world leaders, historically, have not been particularly well educated. I would imagine the present lot are probably the best educated of the lot. And that's your problem. Liverpool won last night. Yes, correct, Angela. Nothing gets past you. Nepal says D. We love Nepal. Where the Gurkhas come from, we love the Gurkhas. Uh, so... 
can't lie, your voice, you would be a great narrator. James, what a kind thing to say. There we are. There we have it. Follow us, guys, as soon as you come on. We need a big, big follow fest on this channel, I can tell you. Can somebody go and like the Scotty McClue videos, every single one of them? Tell us when you're going. Tell us when you're coming back. I've had half a million viewers, and I've only got 12,000 followers. I love my followers. They are beautiful people, but everybody should be following. In fact, everyone on TikTok should be following Scotty McClue's lives and should be following Scotty McClue's channel and should be liking and should be on Scotty McClue's YouTube channel. Think you do actually buzzing to find you, my friend, listening to you in the car and watching you work. RW69, thank you. Are you from Scotland? Oh, I think so originally, yes. Can Nicola Sturgeon force Boris Johnson to accept an independence referendum? Well, in actual fact, Tom Payne, I love the name, The Rights of Man, uh, by Tom Payne. <clears throat> Nicola Sturgeon, by rights due to the Act of Union, should be on an equal footing with Boris Johnson. So she should be able to say, well, you know, tough luck, but we are going, you know, tell us a story. So there we are, do you support a football club? Not financially, no. Uh, so there we are. Thank you very much, guys. Thank you for your beautiful gifts on here. What a tremendous live tonight. So many amazing people. So that's what we've got here. There's Ross joining us. If you've just joined us, folks, stop scrolling because you're watching the World's Top Talk Show. And we are live on TikTok just for you with Scotty McClue. Uh, hello, Scotty from Paris, France. Bonsoir, be wrong. Oui, oui, je regrette, mais je ne parle pas français très vite si tu parles longtemps. Peut-être je comprends, oui. Je m'appelle Scotty McClue. Je suis le professeur de français à la TikTok. There we are, twerk. Do you want me to twerk? Here we go. Okay, did you like that one? A beautiful twerk, I thought. Fantastic stuff. Now, as soon as you join us, follow us. Woo! I am roasting tonight. I do apologize, guys, for those of you who are finding that I am glistening. It is just absolutely red hot in the studio tonight. Hello from Colorado in the USA. Are you up there in the Rockies? We love Colorado. We love you guys. You're amazing people. Uh, fantastic stuff. Dinky do, I say to every single one of you. And a very, very happy Eid Mubarak. Lovely to have you with us. Dinky do, I say. See you tomorrow from the Scots. See you, Mrs. Bag. Or Mr. Bag, fantastic, lovely to have you with us, Mr. B. Uh, see you tomorrow, everybody. Hello from Kentucky in the USA. We love Kentucky. Thanks for joining us, dinky do, guys. Set your notifications so you can always get Scotty McClue when we go live on TikTok just for you. Woo! Oh, that's better. I'm coming down. I'm cooling down. <laughs> hey, from Ireland. D, lovely to have you with us from Ireland. Which part of Ireland are you from now? Yes, are you from Cork? <laughs> are you from the Derry or the London Derry, depending on your point of view? Hello from Germany. Yeah, guten Tag. Lovely to have you with us. Guten Nacht. Nicht Deutsch sprechen. Ich bin ein Ausland, das ich verstehen. Do you remember me, Adam? How could we ever forget you? Lovely to have you with us. And thank you to a very warm welcome to Scotty McClue's live on TikTok. There we go. The mem, thank you do. Lovely to have you all with us. Fantastic stuff. Now, hello from Scotland, Scotty. Hello, Glenn. Lovely to have you with us as well. Now, I'm just saying, has anybody done any liking? of the videos, if you tap the little photo of me top left, you'll get access to every single one of my TikTok videos. Enjoy every one. How many languages can you speak? Well, just what's required as and when, I say. <clears throat> now, 
What have we got here? Hello from the Mississippi. Have you any stern-wheeled paddle vessels going up and down the Mississippi? Do you still have the Robert E. Lee? Good man, Steer. How are things, buddy? There's La Hoop. Excellent stuff. Scotty, I'm a treaty man from Limerick. I know Limerick. What a great place that is. And I've made up a few Limericks as well. But we do love it. Right, the mem, you'll need to go because you've broken the rules. Oh, boy. Remember, no mentioning of candies. What exercise do you do to keep mentally sharp and physically fit? I wind my own watch, and I run up and down the stairs. Uh, there we are. Not too bad, my friend, yourself. Absolutely, yes, indeed. Opinions? Oh, well, we're not going to all that. We don't do the second names. There we are. Not a bother, bud. Thanks very much. Thanks, Lahoub. Excellent. Very good of you. <coughs> Scotty, dinky do, hello Willie. Lovely to have you with us as well. And a big dinky do from Scotty McClure. We like that. That is tremendous. Um, now, what have we got here? I was in Dumfries last week. Have you been there? Uh, meat. Oh, meat. Very nice. Is that an English thing, meat? Uh, Will, yes, I know Dumfries very well. The Dunhamers. What's the thing with people commenting the name I won't mention? It's supposed to be an in-joke, but it's very old, very unfunny, and very childish. So there we are. So off it goes. Now, what do we got here? Fantastic. We love it. I'll just send this wee troll down the river. How do you feel about Maggie Thatcher? Well, I don't really think about her, to be honest with you. She was a remarkable woman, uh, a fabulous politician, a very good prime minister, but she absolutely sucked the economic life out of Scotland and the north of England to make herself look good. So I'm not too, I'm a wee bit dischuffed about her legacy. I love your voice and personality, says D. Thank you, D. You're very kind. Opinion on quantum mechanics. We couldn't do without them, I'll tell you that. Scotty, how long have you been doing the commentary like this? It's a great show. Willie, we've been doing this now for five weeks. Uh, you know, and it is fantastic. Maggie was a witch, to be honest. Well, I don't know, Lahoub, I mean... Uh, I, I came in one night and there was a witch sitting at my computer. And I said, what are you doing? She said, just a quick spell check. No, Maggie wasn't popular uh, with, uh, with Ireland, I have to say. She wasn't the most popular British Prime Minister. I think probably the most popular British Prime Minister with Ireland would be Lloyd George. John Major was very popular. Um... What about Tony Blair? I think you liked Tony Blair, didn't you? Yes, I'm just trying to think back. William Pitt was not terribly popular with Ireland. He split it up. You're so cute. I love your accent. Ha ha, Jaden. Good evening, Scotty. Have a quick cuppa before bed. Have a nice weekend. The real Rory. Lovely to have you with us. And dinky do, I say. What's your favorite alcoholic beverage? I don't have one because I don't drink alcohol. <clears throat> Who have we got here? What about Clement Attlee? Yes, Clem was was very popular in Ireland. Yes, they liked Clem. Uh, Lloyd George wasn't the worst, and Tony Blair not bad either. No, I think, what about Harold Wilson? How did you get on with Harold? And you would have loved old uh, Alex Douglas Hume. He was such a, everybody loved Alex. He was such a gem. <clears throat> Alex and Elizabeth. Uh, Blair got the Good Friday Agreement done. Yes, he did, D. Fantastic stuff. The younger or elder, it was Pitt the younger, I think, and they said to him, Ireland are getting a bit close. They're uniting in their classes. So, in other words, their educated class and their ordinary artisans are getting a bit close. They're becoming quite a power. And Pitt said, don't worry, I shall use the Orange Lodge to divide and rule. And if you look at it closely, the Orange Lodge is still being puppeted to divide and rule Ireland. 
Very, very interesting, isn't it? In a greater, greater or lesser extent, I would hasten to add. But that's what's going on nevertheless. And when you look at the big picture, guys, you will say, do you know that McClue's spot on? He knows his stuff. Clement Attlee, yes, was, uh, well, Clement Attlee is an interesting character because he'd been Churchill's deputy, you see. And uh, he was a public school boy, Haleybury, if I remember right, Haleybury, the same school as Peter Townsend. Uh, so there we go. Hello, Scotty. How are you? Luxury cars. How lovely to have you with us in Dinky Doo. I'm in Lockerbie at the minute. Great place. Will, I used to drink in the Bluebell. Beautiful little pub in Lockerbie. Uh, who's your favourite author? Favourite author of all time? Big fan of Neil Munro. Big fan of George Blake. Big fan of Alistair MacLean. Big fan of Enid Blyton. Big fan of Beatrix Potter. Big fan of Jane Austen. Big fan of Charles Dickens, big fan of Thomas Hardy, big fan of, um, oh, uh, Thomas Hardy as Mayor of Casterbridge, all that sort of stuff. So many favourite authors, you know. I've written a book myself. Well, I haven't finished it yet, but you'll get chapter one. If you go on YouTube and put in Scotty McClure, Deliver Us From Evil, you'll get chapter one. See what you think of it. How do the majority of Scottish people feel towards the royals? They adore, adore the royals. You get the odd half-witted idiot who just doesn't understand how the world works. Uh, and they think that they could do with a republic. But you see, the monarchy is actually a Scottish institution. And we've had a monarchy in Scotland for 2,347 years. And it was the Scottish king that took over the English crown in 1603. So the monarchy is very much part of Scotland's tapestry. Then you will get people quoting the Declaration of Arbroath. That was a, a monarchist document. It was written by the aristocracy as a letter to His Holiness the Pope in, uh, was it 1340, uh, asking if they could choose their own king rather than the Pope choosing him. So there you are. So that's the truth of it, guys. So the majority of Scottish people are very, very, very pro-royal because if you think about it, any anti-monarchist in Scotland is putting independence at risk because the Queen will have to give it her assent if you have a new Scotland bill. There we are. Fantastic. Sheesh. No, you sheesh. You go away and sheesh. Cromwell was our most hatred, Scotty. Would not agree from hatred. Glad he met his doom at the Tower. Cromwell was a real baddie, Willie. But so was King Billy. King Billy was a very, very bad man. I'm sorry for the poor orangeman to have to hear that, but that's the truth. Any creek, Scotty lad? Yes, hours and hours of creek. You need your own radio show. Thank you, Dee. I think I do, but... I am loving TikTok, and I think it'd be nice to become TikTok famous, but that's up to all of you to help by liking all the videos, by following me, by sharing the lives, all that. Blair did a great job. He got things done quick. He did stare, yes, and effectively, yes, he was very good. I'll tell you another wonderful man that you'd have loved was Errol Fitzwilliam. In the 1500s, he got sent back from Ireland for being too pro-Catholic. He got recalled as the, uh, was he the Viceroy or the Ambassador? Can't remember. Have a good day, Secretary of State, maybe. What's your favourite film? I've got so many, Will. I'll tell you what I saw the other day, Colditz. And uh, it's a fabulous old black and white movie, 1957, John Mills. Uh, who's playing uh, Pat Reed that wrote the book about escaping from Colditz. And in 1942, Airy Neve, 
who sadly the thugs and terrorists in Ireland blew his legs off. This man had gone through the war, was imprisoned in Colditz, escaped from Colditz, became an outstanding politician. Aerie Neve, lovely, lovely man, and these cowards um, killed him, you know, for no reason, in cold blood. There we go, shocking. There we are. That's why Ireland gets a bad name, guys. So wipe all that from your... Uh, from your, your minds. Um, I don't like the orange walks of Skyot, no, but they believe in the crown and the Bible, so a bit of respect for all. Do you support independence, Scotty? Yes, I do economically. I'm not political. I'm not a political animal, but economically I do. What do you think about Russia looking to invade the Ukraine? I wish people would stop invading the US. It's very expensive to set yourself up as the world's policeman as Russia, China and America will testify and Britain Britain did it for a while as well so there we are Scotty was Churchill one of your best leaders uh, Churchill himself was a very very flawed character but um, he was an outstanding warmonger and an outstanding war leader, but the man himself had many flaws. For instance, he backstabbed anybody that got in his way, fell out with them, argued with them, that stuff. So there we are. So he was very, very, very big on himself. But he was also a remarkable man. And when I stayed in London, I stayed in Queen's Gate. And I hadn't realized, but Queen's Gate backs onto Hyde Park Gate, where Churchill lived. <laughs> Interesting. The Ross cost us less than five pounds a head. Oh, much less, Jackie. The Ross cost us a packet of crisps. I think it was 60p or something like that. I mean, you'll not get much of a packet of crisps for 60p. That's a lot. How are you, Scotty? You see, the Royals are self-financing, and every half-witted idiot thinks, oh, they're taking out from us, you know, because they don't understand. They don't know the big picture. There's Kyle saying he hates the Royals. Kyle, never hate anybody. If you're an Irishman, fall in love with the Royals because the Irish love our present royal family. She came to see you. The president loved them. Uh, Prince Philip was there. You know, so they're very, very popular in Ireland. So you get rid of your hatred, Kyle. Don't ever hate anything because you're shutting off an avenue of learning. So drop your hatred right away. That's step one in being a top man. What's your stance on Scottish independence? I think go for it. Certainly go for the referendum and uh, ignore the unionist news because uh, they are just wanting Scotland's money. You know, they're treating Scotland as a cash cow. And Queen of Scots, yes, she was, but she was responsible for the union. King William pulled the rug financially on the Darien scheme or the Ryan scheme in the Isthmus of Panama. And then Queen Anne got parachuted in. And she uh, <laughs> she built Blenheim Palace for the Duke of Marlborough, Churchill's ancestor. And she had terrific fights with Sir John Vanborough, the architect. Woo! I wouldn't like to have been in the room with that pair. She was very, very explosive, Queen Anne. Uh, so there we go. But um, she was the one that did the jiggery-pokery, bribed the Scots to give up their country for about 1,500 quid, I think the bill was. Although there was uh, 36,000 pounds that disappeared. I think it was 36 grand. I'll check that for you. That was a lot of money in 1707. We want freedom. You've got freedom, Carl. You've got as much freedom as you can handle. So just remember that. Okay, chum. Yep, then the Germans took over. No, 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 no. Less of the, um, we'll have less, the Hanoverians did take over, yes. But we'll have less of the xenophobia, please. The Queen herself is 50% Scots. Her mother was 100% Scots. Were you friends with Sean Connery? Sadly, I didn't know Sean Connery, but my aunt worked in a shop in Ardrishig in Argyll in the 1960s, 50s and 60s. And uh, she looked up from the counter one day, and here was this gorgeous, big, handsome man. And it was Sean Connery 
and she was serving Sean Connery. They were filming from Russia with love up at Loch Kriegnish with the um, fairy, fairy huntsman motorboats. I think they were huntsmen's. So there we go. Fantastic. After the Georgies. Wow, I love your knowledge. D, you're very welcome to it. That's why I went to all the trouble of acquiring it so that uh, everybody can enjoy. I love your voice. I thank you so much. I said very, very kind of you. Now, guys, how are we doing for time? Oh, I need to go. Where can I get that badge? Do you love the Scotty McClue badge? Listen, make me TikTok famous. And we'll get the merch out there. Scotty McClure says dinky do to every single one of you. Guys, follow me. Love all the likes. Get on to the YouTube channel. And uh, we will catch up with you as soon as. I'm going to say goodnight to you all now. Goodbye, everybody. Goodbye. Take care, everybody, as you go. Goodbye, everybody. A vita zain, au revoir, and a cheery o. Lovely being with you. Thank you for watching, for your time, for your love, for your kindness, for the lovely presents you've sent me. Uh, there's a paypal.me forward slash Scotty McClure if you want to uh, stick in five bucks. Thank you so much for joining us, and thank you for making my TikTok so beautiful huge. Love you lots. Good night and God bless. Ta-ra, love. Dinky-doo.